All right, hey guys. So this is just a quick, not crazy uh, lighting or anything Snake Sunday video. I have introduced my Conda 100% Het Exantic, 66% possibly Het Albino, to my 100% Het Snow female. You can see there is quite a size difference there. Um, he's probably going to go to this girl next to try to make some, I'm hoping he's had albino. And then I could go for some albino supers that are possibly had snow. That would be real nice. I wanted to breed her to my albino condom male, but he is nowhere near big enough. But let's see here. What are they doing? He is, uh, doing a squiggle dance on her. She was just doing that huff puff deal that they do. Not the puff, but the weird vi- I've shown it before. So hopefully he's trying to lock. I didn't brewmate this year. Um, didn't feel like it. I, I only have three females, so I wanted to see what would happen if I didn't brewmate. And I just got this girl. So I'm going to see what happens. She's, got a, she's a good sized girl, though. She's got to be pushing 400 grams. I haven't weighed her yet. Yeah, I will do a much more extensive video. I have a genetic series going. Or I want to make a genetic series. There we go. She's doing some stuff. I'm still not quite sure if that means she's ready to mate or if she's telling him that she's not. I've seen many females do that. Anyway, I have a genetic series that I want to do. Um, I just need to figure out how to film it, because I set up the tripod and a whiteboard to do it. And it, the, the, tri or the whiteboard was very reflective of the new LED light. And it was difficult. It was difficult to figure out how to do it. I'll sort it out. I'll get it figured out. Um... But yeah. Anyway, that's what's going on with these guys. I am starting my breeding season. Probably a little bit earlier than some people. But I'll keep you guys updated as to what happens. Oh.